Over these next several days, we will celebrate the fullness of church. We as the church militant will turn and to thank God for our saints, for those men and women who've gone before us, the church triumphant. They give each one of us hope. You know, as we study the lives of the saints, we realize that each one of them had a challenge that perhaps almost seemed insurmountable. But through their incredible faith and through their perseverance, they faced every obstacle that was given to them and continued to walk in the path that Jesus Christ had set for them, trusting in his guidance and trusting in his love. We build our church on the shoulders of these men and women. How blessed we are to have a saint among us, Father McGivney, who will be beatified on his way to canonization who walk the streets of Waterbury, walk the streets of New Haven. We never know who the saints really are, do we? If we watch them and we see them living Christ, we know they're on their way, however. And then we remember those who have gone before us, the church suffering, those who are waiting that time in purgatory for the beatific vision to be entered into heaven with all the saints. We are truly blessed as a church as we come together to celebrate these holy days. We thank God for our saints, and we pray for those who've gone before us for their hope of eternal life. And as a church, we continue to stand strong in the midst of the challenges that these times put before all of us.